red dot. Now we are. Um, so we have the small side and we have the larger side. The larger side is always the liquid side. And so um, on this tank, the same type of thing. The larger side is always the liquid side. And some of the newer tops we've created, they're the same on each side, but the way you can tell is that the tube coming out is always bigger. And um, so we're going to take this tank and we're going to hook this up. <laughs> Sorry. We're going to put that on finger tight first because finger, otherwise if you put it on, try, if you, got, you don't want to cross thread it because if you cross thread it then it will, you won't be able to, you'll have to replace this fitting. So if you, in other words, you know what I mean by cross thread, cross, the threads aren't lined up. So if you use your hand to feel the threads, you know, get it lined up. It won't go on cross-threaded if you're, you know, with finger tight. And then you can finish tightening it. And it uses a, um, a compression fitting. It's a flare fitting. You open up this li liquid side, then you open up the vent side. You see they got a little bit of pressure in there. Halfway. And you see the pressure going up. Once it goes above about 15, 20 psi, these side vents start popping, popping open. You see the feel gas escaping. And I prefer to keep them under 25 psi. You see that's cold, but it's not cold enough to burn them. And you can put a muffler on it. There's a um, a muffler you can, you can put on the end of that and it'll quiet it down quite a bit. And it's basically just a muffler like you buy uh, for a compressor. Uh, it's leaking right here, so because it's gotten cold, I just need to tighten that down. So it was just because that shrunk more than this did. Now once it got cold, I just have to tighten it down. Now what does that mean when it, when it gets done? It means that it's going to be tighter. And so it's just going to go more effort to crack it open, but that's not a big deal. So then that will go for another 10 or 15 minutes. So we'll just stop right there and then re record when it starts coming.